Hi folks, thank you for taking some time to see this video. Here today I want to show you how simple you can use your Gen X3 to produce chemical free sanitizer and disinfectants. Now it's very simple. My name is Roman Fick and I'm the president of Gen X3. For a second just don't mind me turning my back to you. I'm not trying to ignore you. What I'm doing here actually is filling in the container. There's a, a spot on the container that says maximum 14 milliliters. That's all you put, run the water up to. That go, that's going to give you 13 and a half ounces of your sanitizer or disinfectant. All right, you have your water. Next thing you want to say, make sure that you have a source of power to generate it. So you plug in your power cord and you plug it into your base here and you see the blue light? That means it's ready. Good, we have it ready. Now what's the next step? Let's take some catalysts. Now this little container of Gen X3 catalyst is good for 160 refills of this container. So you've got a long way to use it it's in your box ready to go. You take out the scoop. Make sure your hands aren't wet and you don't put it in the water because you want it dry. You put in one scoop, not two, not three, and you kind of spread it around. Try to sprinkle it around without touching the water. Once it's in there, fine, replace it. And when you close this, this is not closed. You have to make sure both sides are snapped so you don't get moisture in, into this product. Now, I'm going to put, I already screwed on the sprayer, I'm going to put the top on it. Make sure you don't cross thread it. Just take it slowly, bring it around, and make sure it's, it's closed. Take and swirl it just a little bit so the catalyst, whoops, you see what I mean? It's, it wasn't shot right. That's easy to do with this thing, so make sure you do it just right. Even presidents of companies can mess up. Now, there it is swirled, it's not leaking. What we do is put it in the container and just push this button. And you'll see the lights are blinking on and off, on and off. That means the unit is running and all these bubbles should be coming up. You see how simple that is? The blue light comes back on after you get a beep and, and the lights stop flickering. That means it's totally done, it's ready to use. Now one important factor, if you get asked by anybody, no matter who you are, this is, this unit is EPA, FDA, and USDA approved. Thank you for watching.